News 8 is putting your pest problems first tonight, and we are getting a lot of calls. Maureen joins us now from Studio B Live talking about those icky bed bugs and how to avoid them. Maureen. That's right, and the number to call is 287-8005. Now through 630, there's about 20 minutes left to get your question in for the fine folks from Exodus Exterminating who have been taking a lot of calls, as you mentioned, Adam, since uh, we began this at 5 o'clock. Joining me now is General Manager of Exodus, Dale Larner. And Dale, I uh, wanted to vote just a minute or so to bed bugs. Despite the fact that we don't hear a lot about it anymore, this is still a problem, isn't it? It's still a major problem. A major problem. Yeah. Good 10% of what we do is bed bug work. We have a dedicated bed bug team that that's all these guys do day in and day out is bed bug work. So. so I'm just your average person, and I suspect that I have a bed rub problem. Or do I call, what do I do when I, what happens when, when I get an exterminator, and what are they actually going to be doing? They're going to do an inspection to look for signs of bed bugs. Obviously, there's the, a live bug if they can find a bug, but they're going to do an interview with you to find out if you've had experienced bites, um, maybe blood stains on your sheets, um, dead bugs even, you know, uh, shed cast skins as they grow, they go through their development process, they shed their exoskeleton. So we're looking for that evidence that there's bed bugs present. And then after that, is it, is it an involved process to make sure the area is cleaned up? Yeah, there's a number of treatment methods, um, heat being one of them, where you superheat the room or the structure above 125 degrees. Um, then there's your conventional insecticide approach, which is the most common because it's the most cost effective. Um, and then there are some alternatives too, like steam and things like that. Mm, all right. Who knew that it's yeah. that common a, an, an issue? It's still a big issue, yeah. We're doing quite a bit of bed bug work still. All right. Thank you, Dale.